Are you all ready for bed, I see? Snuggle up under those blankets and carefully listen to me. With your pillow underneath your head and slowly closing your eyes, let's all get comfortable and get ready for a story surprise. Whether we venture through the forest and make new friends or fly off through the distant lands, you can always depend. After you listen for a while and you start to nod off, you can count on us to give you a great snoozing send-off. Welcome to another story for you. Hi, boys and girls. I'm Snoozy, the Bedtime Bear. And today, we have a story for you of Jerry the Young Giraffe. Jerry the Giraffe lives on the African plains and is awed by all the different animals. He's so impressed by all of the great talents and abilities that the other animals have that he doesn't appreciate what makes him special. Fortunately for Jerry, his meerkat friend takes him on a journey do 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 to help Jerry recognize just how special he really is. Jerry the Young Giraffe Far, far away on the plains of Africa under the bright hot sun sits a young giraffe named Jerry. He comes from a large and proud family of giraffes whose necks are the tallest in the land. They had been grazing on some trees in the area for quite some time while Jerry sat bored on the grass beside them. He's looking out across the savanna at all the other animals as they go about their day. He watches as the cheetahs sprint across the vast open fields, moving almost faster than he can see. He sees the rhinos charging from behind some bushes. They hold their head up high in the air. Down on the ground a family of snakes slithers through the grass trying to be as sneaky as they can. There are amazing animals everywhere he looks. Huge stomping elephants, noble galloping zebras, jumping climbing monkeys, each one with something that makes them very special. Jerry doesn't feel very special though. While his family has always been very proud of their long necks, he never saw what was so great about it. Why do other animals get to run or swim or fly 
while all I have is a great big neck, he thought to himself. Jerry laid his head in the grass. His family still chewing on the leaves up above. He was just about to fall asleep when something popped out of the grass and surprised him. It was his friend Mikey, the meerkat. He had come to see if Jerry wanted to play. Well, hello there, Jerry, he exclaimed. Another beautiful day today, isn't it? Jerry lifted his head from the grass and replied, Yeah, I guess so, Mikey. Well, how about we make the most out of it and go play somewheres? asked Mikey. I don't know, Mikey. Thanks for tuning in. That was a short preview of another story for you. Boys and girls, click the like button. And when you come visit us, you can download your favorite story or just print out your favorite picture to color yourself. Goodbye for now.